What's up everyone, Wizard Ken here, and today is Tuesday, so you, well, you don't know what that means, but today is going to be Fan Friday slash Tuesday. That's right, guys, I decided to go ahead and do a Fan Friday on Tuesday because we skipped it last week. We were doing Battlefront live stream. I thought it would be a lot of fun, but a lot of you guys reached out to me and said, I really want to see Fan Friday. What happened to it this week? So... I said, all right, that's it. I'm going to do it on Tuesday so that you guys can see all the cool things that you were going to see um, last Friday, but didn't because you were too busy playing with me on Battlefront. But anyways, nonetheless, I have some really awesome videos for you guys this week. Uh, now, if you don't know what Fan Friday is, it's pretty much all of your guys' submitted uh, videos from World of Tanks. These are all recorded by you guys on the Xbox One because uh, you do have that capability to be able to do that. About a 15 second clip here and there. Uh, but anyways, you guys submitted these uh, clips to me. They're either your like best shots, uh, your stupidest moments, funny things that have happened to you. And let me tell you, this has probably been the best week for these videos. I swear to God, it is probably one of the best weeks I have seen. You guys have some amazing video clips and I can't wait to show you this week uh fan friday so anyways without further ado let's jump on to our first person and see what's going on Alrighty, guys so the first person we're going to be looking at is billy mays 234 now he submitted me a video actually he sent me a message about this video and he said you really have to check this out i have a yog panther being pretty much a dick to me now i kind of changed up his words he told me other things but i'm gonna say he's being a dick and has a very big vendetta against billy and his is4 so let's go check this out Alrighty, guys so we're watching billy Mays here he's in his is4 and you see a yog panzer e100 coming up after him now we are on dragon's ridge and he's getting pushed over a fucking cliff look at this he's trying to stop it <laughs> the yog panzer's like fuck you you're dead he didn't even get to drown. He hit the side of the mountain. <laughs> and the young parents just like, eat that prick. <laughs> oh my god, that is just so funny. I mean, you can just see the young parents are, he's probably just inside like, you know what? You've pissed me off for the last time. Fuck you. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. So the next person we're going to be looking at is Dice087. Now... He didn't submit this personally. Actually, Rambo, uh, one of our moderators from our live stream, uh, they do hang out here and there. And he saw this video clip from Dice and he had to submit it to me. It was fucking great. I love this video. It is really, really great. Now, Dice is sitting there and this is really the whole new meaning to death from above. Now, let me just give out the landscape real quick. We are going to be on Dragon's Ridge. So anyways, without further ado, let's watch this video. All right, guys. So we see Dice and he's rushing in to jump on this tank. <laughs> and he survives. <laughs> oh gosh, that is so freaking funny. Watching Dice, you just see him leap right over not he doesn't even know if he's gonna make it on top of the guy like there was a good chance he could have overshot or something but no of course he doesn't and he lands straight on top of the guy <laughs> that that was so freaking awesome Alrighty, guys so the next person we're gonna be looking at is elite tanker now he sent me a message saying has this ever happened to you and usually when i get messages like that it's something uh dumb that happens like maybe they got tracked because somebody ran them and they didn't understand that getting rammed can track you and stuff like that or they get pushed off the edge of a mountain we've all seen that but i bet you in this next clip you guys have not seen this happen ever before i've never seen it i thought it was the funniest thing and i'm going to call this one ballerina slash texting and driving let's check it out all right guys so we see elite dangerous he's in his tank destroyer and he gets sandwiched with these two tanks and they lift him up like a ballerina and he just sits on top i can't even talk <laughs> and he's so excited he's like awesome this is where the texting and driving comes in he rams it to the plane not once but twice <laughs> he was so excited he rammed into everything <laughs> But seriously, just to see him get lifted up like that, they were like, oh, <laughs> it's just so 
freaking awesome. Oh, God. All right, guys. So the next person we're going to be looking at, we've seen him before. Metallica Boy 81 is back, and he has a really cool shotgun experience with his T92. Now, if a lot of you guys don't understand, the T92 is a tier 10 uh, American artillery that doesn't have a, the greatest uh, accuracy. And, I mean, I've seen people shotgun with them, but usually they're a lot closer than where he's shooting. But I got to tell you, this was a very lucky shot, and I thought it was worthy of a fan Friday. Alrighty, so we're watching Metallica Boy right now. He's just sitting at the base, and you can see that there's a medium tank coming in. He's just waiting, just waiting. But from where he is on the map, it is a pretty long distance. Um before that guy comes around and I don't know if he wanted to shoot him this far out but he definitely attempted and we'll see what happens the enemy is the base. look at that enemy <laughs> everybody loves a good shotgun and you know that guy was like there's no way the artillery is going to get me he was probably thinking that and you know what majority of the time 99% of the time that distance I've seen a lot of people, even myself, shoot people, you know, shoot past people and not hit them. I mean, I've had that happen like four or five times today. I've seen artillery trying to shotgun at that distance and miss. And this was just badass. I mean, he didn't even just do a splash damage. He actually hit him on the side, killing him completely. Alrighty guys, so the last person we're going to be looking at tonight is Sergeant Shocks. Now, I've received this video from actually his friend off of Twitter and he was like, this was a badass uh, moment for him in his KV-2, and pretty much I've never seen anything like this. I thought it was super badass, and if anybody else has seen anything like this with a KV-2, you please leave a comment and, and, and let us know about it, because I think he should get some kind of special rewards for being able to do this with a KV-2. I thought it was possible to be able to do, but I've never, ever seen it happen. Um, and we're going to call this one two for the show. All right, guys. So we're looking at Sergeant shock and I apologize for the quality of this video, but let's see what he does when he gets it. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> I apologize for the quality of the video, but unfortunately it just didn't go through the Twitter account very well. And even when I tried different methods, it just wouldn't come out very clear. Uh, so I apologize for that. But you could see what he did with this KV-2. This thing was bad ass. I mean, being able to get down, you know, shoot at somebody and kill both of them. I mean, the KV-2 is just a really nasty tank with that derp gun. I mean, I've been one-shotted by them. But to be able to shoot and kill two guys with one shell, that is amazing. I have heard of other tanks being able to do this, like the uh, Death Star has done that, or even an artillery, but I haven't heard of a KV-2 being able to do it. I do know that the derp gun does have splash damage with its shells, but that, that was just freaking amazing. So, uh, great job, guys. Great job. Alrighty, guys, so that wraps up this week's Fan Friday slash Tuesday. We will have another Fan Friday this week again on Friday. I promise you I'm not going to be doing any other games on, on Friday ever again because you guys are like, give me it. Where's my Fan Friday? And I'm just like, okay, don't kill me. I swear to God, I'll just do it. Anyways, <laughs> but thank you guys so much for your video clips. These were awesome, and I hope you guys thoroughly enjoyed them. Thank you for everyone that submitted these. Now, if you want to be a part of Fan Friday, all you have to do is send me a message on Xbox One saying, hey, I have this awesome video clip of me in such and such tank on this map. Make sure you let me know what tank you're in and what map you're on so that I can find it pretty easily because all I have to do is look for the map and the tank and then also just look at the date that you sent me the message and it's you know takes me like two or three minutes to go through your stuff i mean a lot of these people have a lot of videos and it's pretty easy for me to find uh their stuff so anyways that's all you have to do uh now the other person sent me a message through twitter telling me to go check out their stuff but they actually linked the video in there so you can do it that way but the quality isn't the greatest for some reason um running it that way so i would prefer going through the xbox one anyways guys i'm wizard ken thank you so much for watching this video please hit the like button leave a comment if you're new to the channel and you like this kind of stuff hit that subscribe button we're doing this stuff all the time we live stream on saturdays and sundays and sometimes on my days off 
um you know we do countdown so you guys can come and hang out with me and stuff so anyways guys i'm wizard ken thank you again for coming out until next time see ya